Hey, in this tutorial I want to show you how you find out chords to any song with Sonic Visualizer. Let's say you have a YouTube video like this one or some music files on your computer and you want to find out the chords they are playing. I want to show you how you can do this with software using Sonic Visualizer. Sonic Visualizer is available on Linux, Mac and Windows. I'm doing this on Linux, but you can also do this on Mac or Windows. The first thing you have to do is to download and install the software for your platform. For finding out the chords, we have to use the plugins. We are going to VAMP plugin download page. The two plugins we are using are Cordino here and Queen Mary plugin set here. For Cordino, we are going to the download page here and download one of the files here for your platform. We are doing the same with the Queen Mary plugin set, going to the download page and downloading one of the files here for your platform. All you have to do to install the plugins is to extract the files and move them into one of the folders here. Let's say you are on Linux, then you have to move the files to this path or this path. When you are done installing the plugins, you can open the Sonic Visualizer software. This is the Sonic Visualizer software. I've opened the mp3 file from the video you just saw. All we have to do now to find out the chords is to click Transform, Analysis by Category, A to N and Cordino Chord Estimate. On this window we are just clicking OK. When the plugin is finished you can see the chords here. Let's play the song. We are now under D. And there comes the chord change, G and A and D. Let's skip forward. Here's a part of the song with more chord changes. Let's play it. From a G to the A to the D to the B minor to the A and back to the D. Maybe you've heard that there is a click when the chord changes. We can change the settings here and change from a tap, let's say to a kick and click OK. Start the song again. Now you can hear the kick. If you don't want to hear this, you can click here to disable it. The next thing we want to do is to find out the whole key of the song. We click transform again, analysis by category, A to N, key detector, key. Then we click OK. We can now see the key of the song here, D major. Thanks for watching this tutorial. If you like this video, leave a like or comment down below.